Welcome back to Airstream Wheeler. Last week I introduced my 1977 Airstream Argosy 20-foot motorhome. His name is Dreamboat. This is not my first Airstream project. I know for motivation reasons and scheduling, I need to front load some of the more unpleasant tasks. I am never going to be more excited to work on Dreamboat than I am right now. It's a nice warm day and I'm applying a heavy coat of aircraft stripper to all the painted surfaces. I find that I get the best results between 70 and 80 degrees, not too hot and not too cold. This process is definitely going to make Dreamboat look worse before he gets better. Argosies used imperfect panels that couldn't be used on airstreams and sometimes have plastic body filler and blemishes. I'm already aware of several areas on Dreamboat's body where there is plastic body filler hiding or repairing damage. I think my strategy moving forward on this project is going to be to really just sort of embrace the damage. I'm going to strip all the layers of body filler off and then polish out the scratches and just accept the fact that he's not perfect. Please like and subscribe and ring that bell notification for more Dreamboat content. I will be stripping and pressure washing Dreamboat several times to get the desired result. Plastic scraper is often my tool of choice for those stubborn paint spots. In order to replace that side panel, I know that I need to get Dreamboat adequately stripped. It won't be a perfect job, but it should be good enough